will teach you some basics about Python coding. First, introducing Python. Python is a programming language that can be used to do some basic tasks. If you use it with some other languages, you can also build interesting websites and apps. For example, Netflix and Instagram are also made by using Python. Python can be said to be a language for beginners just starting how to do coding on computers. In the screenshot below, you will see the message print hello world and the green triangle. The green triangle when pressed will start the typed codes. You first will want to know how to check the results after typing in codes. Print is a type of command used in Python. The speech bubbles are used to indicate the message the user wants to input into the computer in order to print it out. Therefore, if you use the print function and put it put in the message you want to print after that, you will be able to print the message out in the console section by pressing the green triangles. A comment is also one of the most important features of Python. In order to do this in most computers, you would highlight the words and press command slash. Once you make a line into a comment, it will appear like this in the screenshot below in a dark green color and the computer will ignore the entire line, which means that the code will appear in the console even after which means that the codes will not appear in the console even after it runs successfully. It can be used in many different ways, like when you want to check errors in the code. You can also use Python as a calculator by using arithmetic operations. You can also use the plus minus multiplication division operations we use in our daily lives in Python too. If you look into the image below, you will see the console printed 2 instead of 1 plus 1. Here, the speech bubbles are not used because we're not printing 1 plus 1. If speech bubbles are not used, and instead with an arithmetic cal calculation, the computer will do the calculation for us and print out the final results. This goes the same f with subtraction, multiplication, and division. Variable, variables are used to assign values. Here we have assigned the value 5 and 3 to x and y respectively. x and y will be our variables. Because we just assigned the values to the variables, we don't have to write 5 and 3 every time anymore because x and y will now act like 5 and 3. So they are the replacements of those number. So in the image be below, we assigned values to the variables, and then instead of writing 5 and 3, we wrote x and the y, but the console successfully printed 8 because the variables were a replacement of the numbers. This becomes very useful when doing complicated calculation. This is the end of the first video of Python coding. And I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much.